content and budget. If you get your message right in the content that you use for your Instagram ads, then you will experience a lot more success. You need to ensure that your message is on point and really resonates with your target audience. What kind of voice will you use in your content? Do you want a formal voice or a casual one? Think about the tone you are going to use as well. Here you have the option of being in your face and provocative or friendly and warm. You will get the best results from your Instagram ads if you are consistent. Around 60% of the top brands that use Instagram ads use the same filter for their content. They consistently put out the same message, which helps to reinforce their brand in the minds of their target audience. Your message will really resonate if you know what your target audience really wants. This will help you to decide what kind of angle you should go for with your Instagram ads. Do you want to inspire your audience? If you are targeting millennials, then you could promote a cause that you support as this is popular with them. The best content creates a connection with people. You can use Instagram analytics to tell you which content your target audience has responded the best to in the past. Once you know this, you can make sure that you use this in your ads. You need to accept that you will probably not get it right the first time with the content that you use for your Instagram ads. Be prepared to analyze previous campaigns and what your competitors are doing to optimize your content. Instagram hashtags. You can create a special hashtag for your Instagram ads campaign. The reason for coming up with your own unique hashtag is because it will make the discovery of your content easier for your target audience. You can build communities around hashtags and also with a hashtag you can set trends and generate a real buzz. It really isn't difficult to create your own hashtags, but the real trick is to create one that will drive engagement with your target audience. Short hashtags are the best because they are easier to remember as well as it being easier to type in. You also need to make it as clear as possible what your hashtag means. Always test your hashtag ideas for uniqueness as you don't want to use one that someone else has used. When people interact with your hashtags, respond swiftly to build on the awareness and buzz. Decide on a budget for your Instagram ads. You have two options when it comes to setting a budget for your Instagram ads. One, a daily budget. Two, a lifetime budget. When you set a daily budget, you will be able to set a cap on the amount that you spend on your Instagram ads every day. With a lifetime budget, you can set the maximum spend amount for the lifetime of your ad campaign. It is essential that you set a budget to control your expenditure. When you are making a budget decision, consider the schedule for your ad campaign. What time of day do you want to run your ads and what day do you want to launch your campaign? Optimizing your ad delivery will have an impact on your budget. For example, you can choose link clicks in your ads, which will force the Instagram algorithm to calculate how to get you the most clicks for the lowest possible price. As an alternative, you can go for a number of impressions. This means that Instagram will show your ad as many times as your budget will allow. Also, you could choose to go for a daily unique reach where your ads are displayed to as many unique Instagram users for the money you are prepared to spend. When you are starting out with Instagram ads, we recommend that you manually set your bids rather than choosing the automatic option. By choosing the manual option, you are able to decide on the maximum price that you are prepared to pay for link clicks. With the automatic option, the Instagram algorithm will make this decision for you. But one of the advantages of setting this manually, you will have the option to make higher bids than your competitors to try and outdo them. Automatic bidding is a good option if you have a large target audience and you do not have a lot of competitors. For smaller audiences and high competition, then we recommend the manual option for bids. This will stop you bidding too high as well. When you are considering bids, think about the conversion value for your business. Only you know this, and you cannot rely on Instagram for this because they don't know. Be aware that not all audiences offer the same value. If this is the case, then you need to adjust your bids based on the audience you are targeting. The final decision to make that will affect your budget is when you want your ads to be displayed throughout the day. There is a standard option here, or you can choose the more expensive accelerated option, which will make the pace of delivery faster. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.